hello and welcome everybody, it's me Daily Boy Dits, and this is my Let's Play. Okay guys, we're back on the Wolf Among Us. So this is now part, f no, episode 4, part 5. Um, I'm not quite sure how long's left in this particular episode, but we've not gone past 5 episode, uh, five parts so far in any of the other ones. So this could be the big end, I don't know. Um, quickest update ever, we have found the last shard of the mirror. Um, we have found out a little bit of information about the Crooked Man and the difficulties in finding him and that we needed the mirror to do that, which we knew anyway. We've now just been tasked with assisting Snow sort out general disputes in the business office. And we've got to basically tell Toad that he's got to ship himself off down to the farm. But I still want to find out what's going on with Bluebeard. Bluebeard's pecking your head <clears throat> always there chirping away so we need to do something with Bluebeard pretty soon to find out what he's all about and stuff because he's just been a character that's sort of been in game but not really been a part of it so uh, hopefully that'll come to uh, fruition very very soon okay let's crack on I thought I made myself very clear I see how it is passed off to an underling eh why am I not surprised well, you did cause what damage brings me in here, so maybe it's for the best. Just need a little bit of dosh. You had the chance. It. I tried talking to her about it, but it's like chatting up a brick wall, it is. Now, I'm sure you've got your own Where's agenda, the Sheriff, but I've taken a real wallet because of you, and you can't deny oh, I should that. Put hay to now that we're not in his shop, what more do you know about the crooked man? Don't try to change a subject on me. I need a little bit of that walking around money, you know? My car, total, the gaping maw in my wall, any of us sound nope. familiar? I'm not looking for a handout, just what's right. I need it, Big B. Here, Crane won't be getting any use out of this. Will that do? Crane's money, eh? Well, I suppose that means it belongs to me as much as anybody. Thank you, No props. Use it to get glamour, Tub. You got the money now, so I won't be so lenient if I catch you again. Farm is you always on the table. Snow is not going to be off here, is she? <laughs> He's loving it. She knows. <laughs> Give us the daggers. Blue beer. You want to talk? Now's your chance. I've just made my donation funding this office. So direct your questions to Miss White. Well, at least he's not trying to get rid of me. He's not. <laughs> no. Did you take care nope. of Toad? I mean, I saw the way he left. I know it may not seem that important problem. right now, but glamours are the law He's for a very for good now. reason. You know that as well as oh, I. Oh shit, I missed it. Well, did you or didn't you? Mm, not quite. <laughs> I actually missed that. Fine, then. we'll deal with it later. I know I should be asking <laughs> how it got like this, but I just keep wondering why it happened to Faith and Lily. You've seen his world. Do you have any idea why he'd want them dead? Mm. I don't know if the crooked man killed control. them with his own hand or if it was about. one of his goons. I don't know. Someone did. What would make a person do that? I what genuinely could those don't know. Have done? I don't know. Who's that dead person in the background? I catch the fucker who did this. I'll Let's find out why. Sheriff, Miss White, I believe. Yeah, do you guys know? There. If you do, throw it into the comments. Um, I have but to if say, we I find out within this, this video, then don't. <laughs> but thanks for putting me back together. I'm sorry. I just, I have to know. Mirror, mirror, we're glad you weren't slain. Now please show us that sick creep <laughs> crane. Nice. He's probably still waking up. I do want to know this as well. Yeah, I want to see where he's ended up to. You will get on that plane to Paris, and you will wait for the day the Crooked Man needs you. Until then, not a peep. Otherwise, I get to deal with you my way. So please, please disobey. Wait a minute. Someone's watching. It's us! Hello! No! What? Just happened we pointed you in the wrong direction and looked at bloody mary's reflection oh her that explains that the explains sting. the sting 
I'd rather not have to feel the pain she brings. So, let's not do that again. Okay, okay. Looks like we'll have to track him down later. You're right. We need to focus on the immediate threat, and that's the crooked man. Show Vicky, me the crooked man. We don't have a lot of time. Are you having trouble with the Ryan no. sheriff? Mirror, 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 mirror. No time to pout. No time to pout. So where so does the where does crooked man <laughs> hang out? Superb. In the door. I don't recognize the door, but that's the crooked man symbol on it. Hold off. Oh, gunners. There he is. The door. It moves. We don't said that. I tell you. Yeah, smoke. Oosh. Wait a minute. I know that door. That's Central Park. I don't know when it's gonna move again, but I'm gonna get there before it does. Big go, B, baby, wait. go, go, baby. When you get go, the crooked go, man, go, go, go. make sure you bring Bit him back that alive. Way. <laughs> he has to stand trial. This go, can't baby, be like it was with Tweedledum. I don't care if it gets out of hand. You don't let it come to that. I know that emotions can run high. And you have your reasons to handle this a certain No way. guarantees. But we have to make a commitment to we will bring him back. the law. I can't make that promise. This could turn sour, just depending on how the wind blows. I have to be able to handle it how I see fit. If people are going to have faith in the Fable Town government again, we need to be fair. Show them that we're doing things the right in fairness, way. We do need I to have do enough that. to worry about here while I prepare the case against him. So I'm going to trust you to handle this properly. That is, if you think you're ready. I'm ready! Let me I go, no let me go! Choice. I'm ready, I'm ready! <laughs> Let's go kill him. Right, just, I'm going to burst everybody's bubble right now. I am fully anticipating to bring this guy back alive. <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to say I'm going to do that. And everybody knows I like to use the punch him or pull arms off, etc. Um, however, I personally think we need to bring him back alive as well. Pick up the door, open 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 the door. Um... Kick the door. I mean, we'll we'll whoa. we'll start how we mean to go on to bring him back <laughs> properly. <laughs> w. Run in and jump. Ayo. No. Oh, well, we only just made it. We're in. CM, how's it going, sir? Oh no, I've got no brew left. Damn you. Tim, what the hell are Tiny you doing Tim. here? Good evening, Sheriff. <laughs> I'm here to take you to the boss. Thanks, by the way, for leaving off Tiny. Tiny Tim. You think I'd have Don't outgrown shake. that centuries ago? <clears throat> We're not gonna shake your hand. I have to admit, when they asked me to watch the door, I wasn't sure what to expect when you came through that portal. But I get it. You're not here on a what social the hell call. Am I? What is this place? Or where is it? I know I'm not in Central Park anymore. I'm not sure. I've only ever come in through one of the portals. I don't think you can get in from the actual street. But you can't blame him for wanting to make it hard to find. Because he's a criminal! Mm -hmm. I'm supposed to bring you right on in, so if you'll come this way. Come on, let's follow Look, him. This is the one thing I have to do. Get this Please over don't with. make this hard I'll on me. I'll follow you. Fine, lead on. <laughs> this is the one thing I have to do. <laughs> oh, your life is so rubbish. I just gotta walk down this corridor. I hope I get some turkey at the Thanks end of it, Tiny Tim. This is all I'm here to do, and I don't want to mess it up. <laughs> I know I'm probably the last person you'd expect to be a guard or an escort it's for that matter. Yeah. I was a little surprised myself when they asked You're me part to do of this. It. I thought it was a joke, actually. Tim, how can you be working here? You know who this guy is, don't you? He's not... He's not as bad as you think. He doesn't treat me like some broken little kid. I think he gets what it's like. He gave me a job. And I'm lucky to have it. This is the only option I've got. You can do elsewhere. Just keep that in mind, maybe? Because if you, you and the boss now. go up against each other, the rest of Fable Town is going to get caught in the middle. And if you're here, it can't be good. Don't you realize you're not just minding the door? You work for that crooked bastard, your hands get dirty too. 
It's not so bad. Not so bad? Are you fucking blind, Tim? He's a murderer. So you're telling me you agree with everything Crane nope. does? We're murderer, though, in fairness. A lot of us depend on him. Some of us never get to the front of the line at the business office. But he's there. We need you, but we need him, too. What we don't need is a It's war. funny, isn't it? Hey, Sheriff, hold up. I oh. gotta go in with you. Can't you just wait up, Sheriff? Hold on. Wait for him. Yeah, Thanks. I can't remember the exact saying, but it's something along the lines of like a, a freedom fighter is bad for one people, but the savior of somebody else. Something like that. You first. Go ahead. You got yeah, we ran out of time there because I was getting scared <laughs> that I was going to mess it up. So I had, to, I had to finish that quickly. Oh, the fun begins. Thank you, Tim. I know the sheriff isn't the accommodating Sexy. Sort, but you handled it. You did well. You can go now. Thank you, sir. Who is he, the crooked man? Yes! Job well done, sir. Job well done. You see, everyone in Fable Town has a role to fill. You just have to pay attention to what they need to help them find it. All my friends are here. Let's have a party. We should have brought one of those pigs and had a barbecue. Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. Don't sit down. Smoke. <laughs> this is what I discuss. Your face. Brilliant. Brilliant. Okay, it's getting good. It's getting good. They're going to try and turn me. I can just tell they are. Okay, let's see what's going to be on next time on The Wolf Among Us. I've heard stories about you. In the old days, how you picked off those men one by one. Oh, how they screamed. The wolf is coming. And they would wait. Hiding anywhere they could squeeze their pathetic, shivering corpses. Some would just drop to their knees where they stood, close their eyes, and wait for death. And you'd give it to them. <laughs> I wish I could have seen it. <sighs> oh well. Sweet. Okay, so a little bit of a teaser there. Not the best teasers that I've ever seen. But yeah, what I reckon they're going to try and do is try to turn me... As I was just trying to say with that Freedom Fighter thing, um, you know, I don't know what the exact saying is, obviously. But you get the gist that basically um, the leader of some kind of revolution um, to the current establishment are uh, pains in the asses. And yet to the people that they're freeing, they are the saviours. So it just depends on what side of the, the fence you sit on. And that feels as if that's the situation here you know the guys that are kind of working for them especially people that are working for them for the crooked man um off their own backs seem to think that he's a good lad you know he's there he's there for a reason and he's doing a, a solid job for them and uh, i can't exactly say that some of the things that we've done are the right things uh, throughout this game but again as i said i was going to try and play this as what i think bigby would have chosen and he wouldn't have chosen all the nice and nice stuff but let's see how we did up against other people early indications uh, looks like we're favoring most people so did you send colin off to the farm you and 85 percent of people decided colin should not go to the farm i wonder if they decided that the same way that i did uh you know like the same with the same ideas behind of not sending him because I don't think we should have just sent him for the, the sake of it. Not just because Snow wanted to uh, impose her authority. Um, not in my opinion, anyway. I don't think it was right. Uh, or did they not send him because they went, Hey, you can't just send him to the farm. He's your friend. Screw friendship. I just don't think uh, Snow had the rights at that point to say who should go and who should stay. Okay, so the next one. So, us and 85.5% did not send him to the farm. Um, did you attempt to remove Narissa's ribbon? You and 64% did not try to remove the ribbon. Yeah, I don't know. I, I think 
I don't think he would have removed the ribbon. There's obviously something to it, and even headstrong as he is, I don't think that would. I don't think we would have done that. Okay, so well, this was the big choice, wasn't it? Uh, which crooked operation did you investigate first? You and 36% of players went to the lucky pawn first. Now, again, as I said personally, if I was in Big B's position, which I saw, I suppose, in some way I was, um, I would have gone to the other place first. That's where I would have gone first. Um, but I think Big B would have gone head down, bit tunnel visioned, and gone straight after the men uh, himself, thinking that that's where the crooked man would have been. So, I mean, you know... This is all up for discussion, guys. Send comments about all this lot. What would you have done? Would you have picked the same thing? Uh, do you think that I chose the right things in respect of the characters in front of us? Uh, did you send Toad to the farm? Again, you and 74% of players decided Toad should not go to the farm. I didn't necessarily not want Toad to go. Um, but he looked like he was down on his monies. Again... I do think he probably should have gone to the farm myself. Um, and I think just the option choices didn't quite show themselves to me in the time that I got to choose. So I didn't mind giving him a little bit of money, a bit of backhand. It worked my money not to give. You know, you know, it worked my money, so why not give it to him? Um, but yeah, uh, I think if I had the option after that first choice, I think I would have said, look, Toad, you should be going really. You know, on you go, sir. On you go. And then the final one was, so it was 74%. Again, people just seem to be playing this really, really nicey nice. And I don't think we came to our choices through nicey nice reasons. Uh, maybe I'm wrong. I'll have to watch some of the people's. Oh, it's mine. <laughs> and the last one. Did you respond to the crooked man? You and 41% of players lit a cigarette. You have to light a cigarette. We couldn't have sat down and gone, okay, sir, you tell me what you think there. That'd be grand. Yeah, fantastic. Of course we're not going to do that. You fools, whoever did that. Um, you know, we're arrogant. We, we're defiant. We're not going to listen to this guy saying sit down. No, we're going to stand there. We're not just going to stand there and be quiet going, I'm sorry. I don't know what to say to you, sir. We're going to sit there. We're going to stand there and go, you know what? I'm going to light a cigarette and blow with the smoke in your face. That's what we're going to do. And that's what we did. <laughs> okay, guys. So what did you think of... Um, Episode 4 overall, as you probably noticed, I've just sat and, and played the whole episode in, in one sitting for me. Obviously, it's going to be five episodes for you guys, so just over two weeks uh, by the time it's all released. And this one's 18 minutes, so I'll release this one separately. Um, yeah, what did you think? Was is this been one of your favourite episodes so far? For me, I think the whole game has been that it's been really story led which we know telltale games are incredibly story led but there's been too much story so far not enough action not enough going on there's not been enough variables it feels like even if we did miss something it's not really affecting the game that we're still coming to the same point um each time uh i don't know are you getting the same sort of feeling i don't know Maybe this is why this particular game slipped under my radar when I like this style of game. You know, with The Walking Dead and all that lot. Cracking games to watch from Telltale as well. Um, maybe this is one of the reasons why this one slipped under the, the radar for me. Again, I, I'm not really sure. Um, we've, we've got one episode left. Don't get me wrong, I'm not for a second saying it's a crap game or anything like that. I think it's been pretty good. I've, I've really enjoyed it. I've sat here tonight and I've just enjoyed the entire episode four. I just feel it's missing some magic or, you know, it's just missing something um, to make it as good as things like, for instance, The Walking Dead or um, what was the other two? Oh, at the exact same time. Oh, when I watched them anyway. I can't remember now. Doesn't doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. <laughs> um but anyway, I'll leave you with that, guys. We've got episode 5 to play. Episode 5 is out now. Um, so I will hopefully record that really soon. <laughs> to be honest, I'd want all episode 4 and 5 all sat there on YouTube. Very nicely being released to your good self. And if you've not noticed by now, I actually have got a bit of a release schedule going on. Um, I'm checking my schedule just here. So, The Wolf Among Us is currently being released 
on Wednesday and Saturday. Um, so it can be literally any time on them, on them days. But Wednesday, Saturday is the Wolf Among Us. And at the moment, Crusader Kings is on Thursday and Sunday. And as you probably, hopefully, and should have maybe noticed, we've also started a Kerbal Let's Play as well. This is more sporadic. It's not got dead on days. Um, the last one went out on Friday night, and I just I just fancied doing one on Friday night. So I, uh, I did the entire... I, I taped the episode... Rendered it, did all the normal stuff, tagged it up, got it out on YouTube, and it's, it's gone down pretty well. So I might send out some Kerbal stuff, um, possibly on Tuesday night, so we've got basically Monday and Friday off. <laughs> um, yeah, and that's, that's us done, guys. So we just hit the 21-minute mark. Uh, hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, of course, leave all the likes, leave all that sort of stuff. Um, you know, comments, 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 comments. This is the sort of game where you can make comments. You know that I'm taping this in advance, but still put comments down. It's good. It's a bit of interaction. And if we do another type of this game, or if there are comments, then and, and you want this type of game, then hopefully, as I'm playing it, you guys will be interacting with me. And I'll only pick that up if it's in the comments to begin with. All right, guys. Loads of likes, loads of subscriptions. Let's get brilliant, yeah! <laughs> and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye for now. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, 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 bye-bye. Bye-bye.